I'm like blending into the couch right now. I'm actually a, a full on human chameleon. I was gonna sit down and answer some of your questions, but I just realized my nips, my nipples, my crip cycle. Me, we, me and my friends, we call uh, nipples crips because nipple cripples when we were kids would go crips. Then we'd try and crip each other. Titty twist, whatever Americans call it. Crips. These hands are made for cripping. And that's just what they'll do. Nip, crip, rip. And dip, dip it in some sauce. I had a strange childhood. And I just realized that my nips like stand out quite a bit right now wearing a white shirt. And my nips are actually pretty big. Genetically, I've got pretty big crips. And then on the topic of nipples, it made me remember that I actually have a third nipple. Yeah, I have a third nipple. I think one in seven or one in nine people have it. I don't know if it's, it's one of those. So let's just say one in eight for argument's sake, right? But that many people have third nipples, myself included. And my stepbrother, Michael, as you remember him. <laughs> I'm about to review a pizza. As you remember him, is that that's bad grammar, isn't it? Mm, I should kill myself. But we've both got third nipples. Basically, I have three nipples. My third nipple is fucking tiny though like it looks like a little mole if i didn't tell you it was a nip or a crip rather then you wouldn't know it was a crip you'd be like oh he's got a little mole under his crip regular crip that is not a mole under my third crip so it's like there and it's fucking tiny but i know it's a crip because if you look at it closely it's a crip it's a full-on cripper like if you wanted to you could crip it if you had three hands i could get triple i could get tripped i could get Crip crypt. I feel like I'm a little lobster right now. Just crips. So whatever, I've got a third crip. So what I'm interested in and what I want you guys to comment on and why I'm making, well, I'm not making this video for that reason. It was going to be questions, but I've obviously gone way off track because everybody's got some sort of defect, you know, like a mole somewhere or a third crip or like a weird toe. Like I have weird fucking hands. I've got little sucker fingers because I bite my nails as well. So my hands are like little Spider-Man suckers. <laughs> You know those little men you can buy? The not little men, like little men, like you buy and then you fuck or whatever. Or have them dance for you. I mean, you're paying for their time so they can do whatever you want, really. You could even play Xbox with them if you wanted to. But those sticky little men, that's just, that's just as bad. Sticky little men. You know what I mean? The little men with like, their arms are out like that and they've got the little balls on their hands. They've got balls on their hands. I can't. I can't. Anyway, you chuck them at the window and they go like... Don't they? They fall down the window and go... That's basically my hands. If I'm like... If a wrestler or some shit picked me up and lulled me at a wall, if my hands were near the glass or the wall, my hands would just go... I would save myself with my suckers. It's not really a defect though, is it? Because, I mean, I just bite my nails and my hands look weird. And the girls never complain. <laughs> my toes are a bit odd as well. I've got little odd alien toes. Alien. I love that word. Aliens. Alien creatures. Whatever. Basically, I want you to go in the comment section and type your defects. You know, everybody's got some sort of defect in some way. Whether it's a mole on, like, right on your nose, which is a pretty unfortunate place to have one. Maybe you've got, like, some weird foreskin that, like, goes, like, I don't know, head growing out of it. But I'm just interested in what other weird things people have got on their bodies, like an extra toe or a fucking, maybe their fingers are gone. I got a mate actually who lost his finger from a lawnmower and literally it cut off half his finger and just kind of like healed into some weird stub. It was pretty hot. Now I've come to realize, friends, I like just sitting on my couch and just talking shit and talking to you guys. That's my new jam, I think. That's my new thing. Put the camera on and just talk about whatever. So I'm basically a really, really, really bad vlogger. That's what I've become now. I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, I'll see you next time.